Moving in is Mutaz. They're in the gate. And they're off. Bursting through Mutaz to take the early lead. He was last in the stalls and he was first to break the line. Out very wide is Al Mazuna as they go through the very early stages. Crossing to the rail, Mutaz has taken the early lead with uh, Al Fakamar now racing in second. Al Mazuna is still very wide out on the track and Numas is being driven along right on the heels of the leaders. Then Istiv Dad is towards the inside rail. Saab is already coming under a ride. AJS Kahir travels well but he's worse than halfway down the field in the early stages. Last year's winner Maz Noon has only got a couple behind. Al Muhit is last but one and Al Rabaya is last of the ten Arabian sprinters as the field turn for home. Mutaz is out in front racing now in second it's Istibdad driven along. Sabu's towards the inside rail and now they're inside the final 350. Mutaz and Marvin Surland still have the lead. In second is Istibdad and JP Guillaume there. Down the outside, AJS Kahir begins to roll and so too Al Muhit. But first run went to Mutaz, going to try and make every single metre. Flashing home is Al Muhit. Al Muhit gets within half a length, comes alongside and breaks the heart of Mutaz. And it was Al Muhit who was up in time. Who was aboard? Guess who? Harry Bentley. First, number two, Al Muhit. Result of race five is now official. First, number two, Al Muhit. Second, number five, Mutaz. Third, number one, AJS Kahia. Fourth, number three, Istibdad. And the fifth horse was number 10, Al Rabia. Two, five, one, and three, the run order. The time, 118.23 seconds. Race five, now official. Race five now, and we welcome onto the podium Ahmed Al Suedi of Al Bida to make the winning presentation to our jockey Harry Bentley. And our congratulations are also extended for a third time tonight to the winning trainer Jasim Ghassali. And finally, to our winning owner for Algerian Stud. And the winning connections of number two Al Muhit.